how can a man and a woman play the same exact role? Where's the balance? So in Africa, it's very clear. The woman plays the role of a woman. Okay? God installed love, emotions, compassion. and compassion in a woman because as a motherly figure, those things have to be instilled. Mm-hmm. Nurturing. Right. This is why women catch so much feeling so quick. This is why they can endure so much pain and still be there. That loyalty, all that comes with them naturally. They think that they we treat them it. like shit. No, I'm looking at the camera. <laughs> I was about to say, they, they, they everybody, this is Mr. Akon. Right. And, and say it, and Antoine agrees. No, but guys, at the end of the day, um, right? I agree. At the end of the day, it's true. Welcome back to my channel, mother suckers. Hey, so Akon has been saying some really stupid things in the media lately, and this one really took the cake for me. While doing an interview on the Joe Budden podcast, Akon literally said women don't create life and men are divine beings. He went on to say in Africa, women know their roles. Their role is basically to support their husband, to be feminine, to take care of the children, to cook and to clean. I feel like when African men speak about African women to people who don't know or haven't been to Africa or haven't really lived in Africa, I feel like they only tell partial truths. They don't talk about how African women actually work really hard as well. Africa is so is so diverse and colorful like you really almost have to break it down to country to tribe to socioeconomic status because there are some women and girls in in Africa certain parts of Africa who cannot go to school because they cannot afford it and so those women who cannot afford education they are home so they are taught to be home makers now there are women who work very hard they own businesses they own braiding salons and braid all day or they work down at the market or women who are educated and they're in school for most of the day right so the dynamic between those women and their husbands would be different than the dynamic between a woman who is home all day also a lot of african households have help they have housemaids right or house servants however you want to call it so they get that additional help because there's other women in the house helping you with the babies, helping to cook, helping to clean. Um, and, and you know, that, that that strong black woman, I really think it started in Africa where uh, specifically African men see African women stronger and, you know, able to endure more pain. Like when he said that, I literally cringed when he said, you know, um, African women can endure more pain because they're women. That makes no sense. A man right now can create life without a woman, but a woman can't create life without a man. If I wanted to create life right now without a woman, I would just shoot my sperm, put it in the incubator, and just give it nine months, even maybe less with today's science, and a, a baby will be born. A woman can't do that. <laughs> y'all really sat around and let Akon convince y'all that if he put his sperm in an incubator for nine months, a baby will be born. Till my baby's born, till my baby's born. No. Akon obviously still has that old, 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 archaic, misogynistic African male mentality, and it just ekes me to my core. My pops ain't getting behind no stove cooking, doing none of that, washing no dishes, doing none of that. The same way my mom ain't about to get at the bus stop and go to work. So in what way? Well, we live in a new reality, okay? The market is not doing good. The economy is crashing, literally. Rent and mortgages prices are sky rising. Groceries, like every, the price of living just, ha I, it's out of control. I can't even talk, like it's out of control. So in most households, yes, the woman has to work. Now imagine putting in as much hours as your male partner to come home and then have to cook and clean and, and have most majority um, care over the children and then get in bed and, and be a porn star and then wake up and have to go back to work and maybe even put in overtime. That is impossible. Women work just as hard or not, if not even harder than most men. And people really need to stop comparing Africa to America because the economy in, in, is completely different. And the economy, people, plays a big role in how the family dynamic, it just does. In Africa, they can afford house help. They're cheap. Here, a maid or... Girl, that's like, that's like getting another car, having, you know, having some help around the house. So 
please, I beg, like, let's really start being real about these conversations and why these two different societies operate differently. Also, let's keep it a bean. There are more laws that protect women in America, okay? If you abuse a woman, yes, there's, um, they're not the best and the laws obviously they need they need a lot of progress um, especially when it comes to protecting black women but in comparison to some west african countries girl okay if your husband slap you and you call the police they're gonna say well what did you do to him no look like you know what i mean like the laws are very outdated you know and they don't protect women in Africa. So that's another strike, you know, against the continent where they need to do better in protecting women from abuse. A woman doesn't have an education or doesn't have her own means to an income. Obviously, she is more inclined to stay with an abuser or in an unhappy home because where else is she going to go? Sound familiar? I also think religion plays a big part into it as well. You guys know that I went to Senegal, was it last year? Yeah, I went to Senegal last year and honestly, the country is incredibly beautiful. The people are very nice. And like I said, there is home help. You know, the women cooked for us every single day. The women stayed home with the children, but there were also some women who went to work every single day and they didn't have children or they weren't married because they had to work. They had to support themselves. So I did agree with about 10% of what Akon said, but he lost me with the whole incubator thing. You know, men don't need women to create life, which is crazy and a lie. And what also gets me is that after all of that complaining about women basically being masculine, he then explains why women are masculine. Check this out. But at the same time, to the woman's you know, point of view, these niggas is full of shit too. Yes. Oh, shit. These women are play, paying niggas rents. Yeah, they are. Niggas mm -hmm. moving like, in to what? live off of women. That's, that's why you can't really blame the woman here in <laughs> no. America. You can't blame the woman here in America. They ain't got no but what happened? So you say you can't blame the woman in America after blaming the woman in America. It would have made more sense if they started with this and then spoke on the result of this. What we're seeing is the results of men in society not stepping up to their quote unquote divinity. When y'all don't step up, the woman has to step up. But we also live in a time of opportunity. Women have a lot more opportunity than they did in Akon's, you know, parents' time. Women have a lot more opportunities even in Senegal, even in Africa, right? So women don't want to stay home. How about that? Some women don't want to. Your best bet is to stop pointing fingers at society and find people within that society that match what you want and what you're looking for. I guarantee you, if you want a traditional woman, you can find that. You just need to, hmm, I don't know, pick better. In the last 10, 15 hey, years, I haven't met a woman that can actually cook. <laughs> I haven't met a woman that actually wants to clean the house. Oh, I can, shit. man, bro, I've, I've, I've met the baddest bitches on the globe and asked to go to the bathroom and the bathroom looked like Still. shit. Still. Hair all over the place, all kind of products. <laughs> like, come on now. Now, there are entirely too many cooking and cleaning tutorials for, you know, y'all not to be good in that department. But practice makes perfect but let me know your thoughts down in the comment section do you agree with akon do you disagree let me know your thoughts down in the comment section and i'll see you at the next one